city didn't come to the public meeting so we, we're giving in this petition to let them know that we are that, you know there are a lot of very concerned people in Tower Hamlets because they have said that there aren't they, they've decided that people are fine with it and that there aren't people concerned about it so we've handed in a lot of names to show quite the opposite what I understand, you know, the missiles themselves are not that reliable and if they were to shoot something down, it'd come on, uh, down on top of all of us. It's a very high density area. Now, I live in the area, my daughter lives in the area, my granddaughter lives in the area. I'm a primary school teacher, I teach very young children. I don't want it coming down on anybody in the local community. <laughs> uh, we've just really been working to, to reach out to the local community, to, to my neighbours, uh, to tell them about what's going on. Because people, there is, it's been said there, there hasn't been a, a proper public consultation by the MOD. People are unaware, people don't even know that these, these missile sites are in very six sites throughout one. Um, and they don't realize, you know, the situation that that puts us in. And so I've been reaching out to the community to talk to people, tell them what's going on, and get their their feedback to really have a voice to make that consultation. It's just people see it as a crazy idea. You're going to shoot a missile into the sky and blow something up, presumably over East London. Uh, so you know, it's a sad day when when a, the government is treating its own people like collateral damage. This one down to